Holly Strano. Happy Friday and welcome to Studio 3. It's September 3rd. Jeff Timmons is with us again today. So good to have you all week. Good to be here all week. I'm going to be sad. You know, I got to leave Aww. again. Every time this happens, I kind of get depressed on the last day. Do you? But it is Friday, though, so you can't it be is. too depressed. It right? is Friday. And so you go back to... California. La La Land? Yeah, yeah well, yeah, La La Land, I guess. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the fun in the sun. Although it's been, the weather has been great since I've been here. It really I can't, Yeah, I you can't bring, complain. You bring the beautiful weather with you. I don't know about that. It's but it's nice. been nice. It's been nice. It's we been appreciate nice. it. Oh, I appreciate it. You had another busy, busy day. You had a signing in, was it Westlake, Westlake yesterday? Westlake, yeah, it went really well. It was uh, yeah. a lot of fun. A lot of, a lot of people turned out. It was great. Were you signing a lot of these? Signing a lot of, look, look at that. Cue I'm, the plug. I think I have to, Thank maybe you. I'll show it to this camera and we yeah. can get it. Hopefully. Oh, this one. All right. <laughs> Okie doke. Whatever, whatever you guys need, I'm there for you. So this is your CD. And That's of course, it. it features that wonderful song, Whisper That Way. Right. Look at how cute you are. A lot of touch up there. A lot of Photoshop. Now, now tell me about that. What's that like to shoot a cover? Is, is it stressful? <laughs> is it... No, but seriously, I mean, that's my least favorite that's, thing about the whole like thing. That's like so, like, you know, yeah, it's, it's so a close. very intimate look there. So, so close. is the camera right there when they're doing that, or are they zooming in they, on your they, face? They blew it up in a, on the with the computer and the, and the studio magic. Really? It was a, a, the shot was actually far away, so they they, really? they enhanced it somehow. They took the wrinkles away. Oh, stop! They gave you me a no little wrinkles. bit lighter <laughs> eyes. Put a little tan to my face. They did a good job. They did a really good Wait, job. With I'll, it. I'm gonna hold this up to the camera again so that we can we can see. I don't think though. I think it looks just exactly. I don't like know. You look. Before, after. No. Before. No. After. See, that's very good. Now, how long? How long did this shoot take? Well, the shoot was shoot. I think lasted for an hour. Mm -hmm. Then that's my least favorite thing about the whole thing. That's really not pictures. that long. I imagine it being like no, like 18 hours or something like right, that. Right, right, right. I'm not a big photo guy. You know, I'm like yeah. get it done and let's go. I want to get back to the studio well, or back to my kids. You know. Oh, you're so cute. Yesterday it was really cute because we saw a clip from your video whisper that way. Yeah. Now, how long did that take to do? The video shoot took all day. That's that's a but long just one process. Day. Just one day. And I feel it, like it's like a movie or something. Well, yeah. You know, some of the I other videos when I was in 98 Degrees were kind of like movies and they were very expensive, elaborate videos and stuff like that. Yeah. So, um, you know, uh, but this one was kind of, we wanted to tone it down, just kind of make it mellow because the song's pretty mellow, you know, it's a little right. bit love ballad or whatever. But yeah, 98 Degrees, we did some videos in Vegas and on top of the Golden Gate Bridge and all wow. kinds of stuff. So, yeah. Boy, the experiences that you have, how neat. I mean, yeah, I've been very blessed. I've had a great time. I mean, yeah. it's been a great ride. I can't complain about any of it. Oh, yeah. right. It's all, we, we really enjoy seeing you. So you had the signing and then you were back from that, like, give us the little day. So we have a day in the life of Jeff Timmons. Well, we hung out with Andrea last night. It was her birthday. The producer of the show. And you all saw the cake yesterday. That's it was right. so nice. And that was a good time. I mean, I think we started hanging out with her four o'clock or something like that. And we were out all night on the town having really? a good time. So if I'm what? looking a little peaked today, Oh. It's because Andrea took me out and ran me through the ringer last night. Were we <laughs> drinking a few places. martinis? Maybe? We did. Yeah, we did have a couple martinis actually. A couple. <laughs> yeah, one. Just yeah. one. Just one. You bet. And it was it was a uh, it was a it was a, uh, a non-alcoholic martini. Of pull course. This, pull this leg. <laughs> Yeah, right. Right. That but sounds like a lot of fun, though. I, I know. I wish, I wish if you didn't have to get up so early, you could have joined us. We would have had a good time. Yeah. No doubt. No I doubt. bet. I bet. So do you actually go back today, or are you steer for the weekend? No, no. I, I leave tonight at 7 o'clock okay. and I get in pretty late. So, yeah. yeah. You have, I know, a lot of family and friends still in the Canton area. Yes, I so do. So do you come back for the holidays and things like that? Occasionally I do, but usually I'm doing stuff w right around the holidays. And this year I'm going to be on tour with Jim Brickman at the holiday uh, for the oh, holiday that's tour. That's such an awesome tour. Thanks. It's a lot of fun. We, yeah. we always have a lot of fun. Jim's, he's, you know, everybody knows how talented he is. I can't believe. And well, and the scary thing is, is we're really going to be talking about that very soon. Yeah, the I know. It's, it's right around the corner. And this, you know, totally the same is. people it's with them on, on tour. Ann Cochran, who's just amazing. She's she local. She's from uh, locally, uh, from Cleveland. Shaker of course. Heights, I think. Yeah, yeah she's, she's awesome. An amazing talent and a great person as well. Yeah. And Christy Starr. Darlene, Tracy Silverman. That's neat because it's it's like a little family. You know, you guys have worked together now for a couple of years. Yeah, this will be really my nice. second year with the tour. Yeah, so. that's very nice. Yeah. Well, we've got a big show coming up again today. That's right. You better believe it. As we get ready to cheer on the Browns tonight and the Buckeyes this weekend, we'll show you some great tailgating tips. All right, and you saw him on NBC's hit show Last Comic Standing, Ralphie Mays in the house. And from hamburgers to baked beans, we'll show you classic rep recipes for cookout favorites. Yum. Welcome back to Studio 3. You watched Last Comic Standing? Yes, I did. I'm a big fan. I was, as we were talking during the break, man, mm -hmm. congratulations on all your success. I've Thank seen you, you on everywhere. I saw you on Wayne Brady not too long ago. 
Oh, man, big fan. Look Thank at that. You, brother. Ralphie May in the house. You are awesome. Hey, everybody. And go Browns, by the way. Yeah, yeah, I did a show for them last year, and they gave me, a, they gave me the jersey. That's and, awesome. Uh, yeah, they were giving me some static, too, because they were tired. It was the end of two days, and they were all sitting on bean bags in an 85-degree <laughs> room. And, uh, and I was just like, they were like, oh, you stink. Somebody heckled me. I'm going, you're, you're bothering me? You don't know what quarterback you're going to use, OK? Oh. Uh, so don't even start with me. I mean, I, come on, I'll fail. Hey, you better watch your mouth. I go, what are you going to do? Come up here, I'll put a goal line in front of me. You won't get past me. Come on, what are you out of your mind? Let's do this. And then they broke down. They were like, OK, now he's cool. He's now, cool. look at that. Now, what is that? That we're, Is that your DVD? That's my DVD and CD. Uh, they went platinum a couple of months ago, and I'm very proud of it. Now, where can, can you, this is everywhere, right? This is yes. out available for people to buy? Yes, you can get it at um, Best Buy. Uh, Circuit City, um, all major record stores. Uh, you can get it online. You can get them autographed at my website, or you can oh, pick nice them up you. tonight. I know. That's amazing, man. For anybody that doesn't know, going platinum on DVD is huge. It's, that is huge. It's so huge. Congrats, man. Thank congrats you very much. Yeah. It's from people. You know, it's just for the people, the fans of the show, and and people who've who've seen me before. And uh, I took a chance, and I'm doing different material now than what I was doing then. Yeah. I'm prepared to do uh, my second DVD. In October, it's uh, going to be a double disc, so hopefully we'll take uh, we'll get some more platinum out oh, of it. That's awesome. Yeah, I'll definitely yeah, be no. picking that up, man. Tell it's us good. about tell us about your experience with the last comic standing. How'd it, it go? You know, it's been great. You know, um, the year my, my father passed away on Sunday, and uh, oh. and I really had a hard time performing on Monday. And uh, the, to the credit of the fans, they uh, sent me over twelve thousand emails of condolences, and um, we had a charity where um, my uh, part of the American Cancer Society, a free hospice that uh, my father was at. And um, uh, it's received over $400,000 so far. Oh, and it's the people out there. They're just amazing what they've done. It's really, really impressive. I'm so glad it's been a great experience. So it's sorry to hear amazing. about your loss. It stinks. It stinks. Very but sorry about that. my dad, I talked to my dad a couple of days before, and uh, he was he was upbeat, and, and he was like, you know, I'm going to make it past it. And if I don't, go out and win this thing or try to. and. Uh, and, and he wanted me to re repeat some jokes that uh, I told him before, and he couldn't remember the punchlines. And so he was, uh, I told him, and uh, he laughed, and he was like, thanks, I forgot that. And, uh, and, yeah. uh, and so when I did the show on Monday, I just did his two favorite jokes, and I did it for him. Aww. I didn't do it for anybody else. I just did it for him, you know? That's very sweet. Yes. All right, so improv. Talk about yes. that. The improv, it's uh, it's fabulous. We're down in the flats, mm -hmm. and I know you wake up too early. You're probably a sleepy bear, you know. Once in a while, I get wild. Yeah, go crazy. Oh yeah. Well, we got an early show pretty, tomorrow. She can we get got, crazy. She can get oh, yeah. we, oh, got, yeah. I'm off weekends. I'm all yeah. over it. Fantastic. <laughs> yeah. Well, tomorrow, we, I mean tonight, we've got two shows, uh, eight and ten thirty. Tomorrow, uh, we've got one at uh, seven fifteen, uh -huh. nine thirty, and eleven thirty. Um, it's awesome. Improv is, is fabulous, and uh, it's a great show, too. My girlfriend's the feature act, and my best friend's the opener. It's awesome. I've yeah. got a great life. You enjoy spending time in Cleveland, don't you? Actually, I like Cleveland, okay? It rocks. It, well, let's don't go crazy. <laughs> okay, but, but, you know... Come on, okay, Ralph, No, rocks. no, no. Actually, it's a good people, you know? That's what I like about Cleveland. Is that it's it's a nice town. It's right here on the lake, clean air, and mm -hmm. nobody gives any static. You know, it's no... There's no upbeat attitude, you know, like L.A., they're kind of uppity, yeah. you know, Dallas is That's uppity. That's the Midwest, and I was just yeah, talking right? about that. Right. I've been all over the place. The Midwest is the best as yeah, far as man. people go. Yeah, as far as people go, like it's definitely the best. The Midwest is the best. Midwest is a little slogan. Where are you from? Mm -hmm. Uh, I'm, I was, I'm Southern. I'm really Southern. I was born in Chattanooga, raised in Arkansas, and moved to Texas when I was 18. Wow. You know, I'm my own cousin. That's how Southern <laughs> I am. <laughs> you know, that's yeah. the truth. Well, you are going to be at the Cleveland Improv this yes. weekend. We've got the information for everybody at home to see. There it is. Fantastic. There's the number. Give that to phone number a call. That's right. Pass it along to a friend, too, 216-696-4677. Yeah, we don't have many seats left, uh, but I want you all to come out and see it if, if you're out there. Oh. And I want to invite you guys, too. Thank you. My pleasure. Be there. So nice to meet you in person. Oh, it's wonderful. It's really it's fun. wonderful. All right. Let's go tailgate. Well, isn't this is really, he's, he's good. Man, I'm leaving. This guy's taking my job. I saw it outside. Yeah, it smells great. Yep. Well, it's and did oh you gosh. know that it's the 100th anniversary of the hamburger? I did not know that, and as a fat guy, I'm remiss in that fact. <laughs> We're going to go out and celebrate. In fact, you're invited to our tailgate. Awesome. All Let's right. go. We'll be right back. Welcome back to 
Studio 3, everybody. I'm with our special guest, Lauren Fix. She's an automotive expert. She's going to tell us about tailgating today. Oh, there's some great trends, Jeff. I mean, people don't think about, you know, they think about all this great cooking, but there's some other trends. And one of the newest trends is cooking. There's three trends. This is the first one. This is a smokeless griller. Now, a lot of people say, yeah, hamburgers are great. And that was an excellent segment. However, what about those of us who are a little low carb, you know? And a lot of places are not allowing open flame anymore. So what do you do? So I found this smokeless cooker. You can use it indoors and outdoors. You can use it year round. But best of all, it's low carb. You can make fajitas. You can put shrimp on it, wrapped in bacon. And you can do a lot of cool, funky things. And that's the big thing right now. Who can outdo the neighbor next to you? Nice, You know, I've nice. got jambalaya. What do you got, you know? So, <laughs> and, 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 and you, you share recipes. And you said smokeless. How is that possible? Because it uses a sterno underneath. And okay. It's kind of like you would see in like a banquet facility, and it's like a little candle. And then what you do is it heats up, and when the pan is heated up, you cook what you want, and it's great because you can use it year-round. Very good, very yeah. good. And those are pretty reasonably priced. You can get any mass merchandiser. Very cool. Now, what do you what do you have here? You have a couple gadgets, this right? This is totally cool. Now, if you're really into the football, you know, we got the Bears coming against right. the Browns, and you know you don't want to listen to their local announcers. You want to listen to our local announcers. Right. So Sirius has gotten real serious about the NFL. They now have the new Sportster for under hundred dollars. You can get yourself a unit that you can carry with you, listen to your favorite anchors as well as the, the visitors if you want, but 24 hour, uh, seven days a week, Every NFL. Game. Every, Every day. day. You can listen Unbelievable. To it. And it's a, over 120 up. channels for $13 a month is a great deal and things you can carry it in your car, you can take it with you and tailgate. So that's something that's brand new. Very cool, the newest trend, and Sirius is the only one that has the NFL. Exclusive. Exclusive, that's correct. Show our folks at home what else you have okay. here. Now here's the other thing, you know, you got to be car care aware. You're standing here in the middle of the parking lot, we're having a great time, and we're burning down the battery in our vehicle. A lot of times that happens. Carry a set of jumper cables, an emergency kit. Don't take that out to put all this gear in. And so that's one of the things you want to think about, a tire inflation product. You want to carry some sort of trunk in case you have an emergency. All these things we take out of our vehicles, that's the car care tip, right. is don't take that out. Sunglasses, of course, bring some stuff for upset stomachs because we of all course. eat too much. And, of course, some suntan lotion. And when you load the back of your truck, I recommend a truck. This is the third tip is get yourself a truck for tailgating. And the neat thing is Nissan just came out with the new Titan truck. That's what this is. And they have four doors. They've got super cabs. They've got long beds, short beds for around $22,000. $22,000. Can we take a look inside? Yeah, I've got to show you the inside of this truck. This is the Nissan Titan truck. And they're really unique. They're unique. They're contemporary in style. They've got that, like, neoprene kind of interior, so it's easy to clean. You can get six people with the, be with the bench seats. You can get five people in this particular model. They come four by four, two wheel drive. I mean, it's it's neat if you're looking for a new truck, but you don't want to try and pack this all into a little Honda Accord. So you want to try and get a truck. You can order a utility track, which is a slidable attachment to tie this down. If you're serious, you're bringing the camper behind you. Right. Or worse, I've seen these people, these huge smokers that they haul behind them on the class three hitch. This has got great towing capacity. Now I got a question for you. A lot of people tailgate and all that. Yeah. You're an automotive expert. Yeah. Talk about safety a little bit, some okay. safety tips. Safety tips, okay. First thing you want to do is don't forget to bring a, a mitt for the grill, right. whether you use that smokeless grill. <laughs> Good idea. I cannot tell you. Seems like common sense, but well, a lot of people probably don't do it. And they go, well, I'll just use a paper towel, and they burn their fingers. Right. Of course, sun, sunglasses and tanning lotion. If you got the kids, a big, big tip is I'm always saying, bring a foam football. Right. You got kids in the parking lot, you got cars. I mean, if you got a brand new car, new Titan truck, you don't want someone hitting it with a regular football. So, you know, get yourself a foam football. They're a lot of fun. Awesome. And you can have some fun. Get that arm working That's right, get the arms going. I see you've been working on those arms a little bit. <laughs> a little bit. Are you going to stick around for the Browns tonight? Absolutely. Terrific, I'll terrific. I'll be here. Well, gonna thanks beat for the Bears. <laughs> yeah, that's right, they're going to beat the Bears. Yeah. Thanks for being with us. Glad we to totally here. appreciate There's it. More tips on my website at laurenfix.com. That's right, laurenfix.com. Everybody, thank thanks, you Jeff. very much. It's appreciate a pleasure it. to see nice you. Nice to meet you. Stick around. We'll be right back with some tickets to Kim Basinger's Cellular Ooh. right here on Studio 3. My pleasure. Really good to have you. You did an awesome job. You always do. We've got a big week coming up. I'm so excited about next week. We're talking to Ellen DeGeneres about her new season, second season of the show. So I'm a big fan. Don't, I'm really, really I mean, she's to she's it. a great. She's got she's an amazing show. Yeah, she really does. And you know who else is going to be by the Donald? Donald Trump Donald. is going to be giving us the inside scoop on the next season of Apprentice. You got to stay tuned for oh, that. Oh, that's fun. That We're out. also talking to uh, Denise Richards, actress. That's right. Very nice. More prizes to give away. That's right. Tickets uh, to the new romantic comedy Wimbledon and DVD copies of Simba's Pride. Very nice. It's going to be a big week next week. Too bad I can't be here. I wish I could. Fine. You can come back whenever you want. But I brought a special friend with me today. You did? Yeah, I got Paul from the Ritz Carl. He's going to come out. He's got oh, some he surprises. Brought, he brought champagne. champagne. So. Yes, my favorite. Champagne. Oh, Thank you, sir. you're welcome. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Paul, it's great to see you. How did, uh, 
little happy hour go for you guys yesterday? It was great. And, you know, the Ritz is amazing. Again, you it know, that you guys are great. Place. They took care of me all week long. Well, Paul, and let's not you. forget they've got that new kids menu, Ritz Thank Kids, you. and it's spectacular. If you have not seen it, you've got to stop by because you'll find some great items like macaroni and cheese with hamburger mixed in and salami and cheese sticks. I love the broccoli trees. All of it was good. The pizza tower was fun. Yeah, probably Monday. He's not playing around, though. Uh, He's, we brought the real deal. This is, this you got some stuff. Dom Perignon here. 50% off Thank Monday you. night at Century. Very 50 nice. 50% off. 50% off when you have dinner at Century Monday nights. Full champagne bottles, half price. Wow. Are you? Wow, that is a great, a great deal. Great reason to come downtown Cleveland. No oh, doubt. you're not kidding. Well, here's to a wonderful Labor Day weekend. Thanks again. Thank yeah. you, everybody. And cheers to you as well. Have a great holiday. And uh, keep it safe. Thanks, Play Cleveland. Smart, right? Thank you. Thank you, Jeff Timmons, for being here. And Paul Carter for being here today Thanks, as well. Thanks, Paul. Appreciate it. It's like a big love fest out yeah. here. <laughs> All righty, everyone have a fantastic Labor Day weekend. We're going to uh, chill out here with a little champagne, thanks to the Ritz-Carlton, <laughs> and we'll see you back on Monday. We'll be talking to Ellen, too. It's going to be very cool. Very exciting.